Okay, this is what I mix. It's ascorbic acid with one half teaspoon per eight cups of water. Eight cups of water equals one half gallon. I put it in this bowl right here. And that's how I get started with my dehydrating apples. Okay, this handy dandy little machine right here slices, peels, slices, and cores an apple all in one go. Let's see if we can get this thing to work this time. Just keep turning, turning, turning. Slide off. I peel a little bit off the ends. Try to get a little bit of the peel off. It's not necessary. I'll leave that chunk there. Now I'll take that one off. It's got it's got a piece of that coarse stuff sticking out. Then uh, that'll slice in half. Full. Then I'll move the camera a little bit here. I do them separately to make sure they, they're separated so the, the absorbic acid and stuff can get to all the surfaces evenly so they don't turn color. One apple. And so I don't bore you, I'm going to go ahead and turn this off now and finish up the apple slicing them. Okay, just so I wouldn't bore you guys too much, I put on most of the tray. I just lay them out like so. I got a Excalibur 5 tray dehydrator. It's mine and the wife, she calls it my toy. I've been drying apples, banana chips, and pineapple. A nice tray of apples, sliced and ready to stick in the dehydrator. Okay, I got her loaded up. See if I zoom in real quick. There's my five tray Excalibur dehydrator, all loaded with apples. Oop. And ready to go. dehydrator done from this. Sure does shrink it down a bit, huh? 